I am going to do a clarification video on Justin Bieber's version of Fast Car. I've got a lot of requests for how the strumming pattern goes, so I'm going to dissect it even more than I have in the previous video. Before you do any strumming, accent two and four, especially four, Justin always comes down with a pick straight down, hits the strings, and the side of his hand is going to hit the strings at the same time the pick does. And you're gonna make more of a sound that's more of a percussive sound than a chord. Like that. So you're gonna go C. He's gonna play regular C, and then he's gonna do super G. Fingers three and four are locked down on the third fret, first and second string. Like that. So C. Then you're going to go E minor, and then D with F sharp in the bass. So E minor or E minor 7, these fingers are still locked down. And you're going to chop on that chord. Like that. So C. So the chop is very important to keep that two and four feel going. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. During the interludes, he'll do the same chords because the chords really never change. It's going to be C, G, E minor, and D with F sharp and a bass the whole way. But during the interludes, he'll go C, and he's going to do two upstrokes. So C. I think what might be throwing a lot of you off is the way he switches the chord. Let's just take C to G. That G comes in one, two, three, four on beat four. Let's say we have four beats in a measure. One, two, three, four. It's C, there's a rest, C, rest, strum. So C, two, three, four. On beat four is G, C, rest, C, G. Like that. Another thing that could be throwing you off is the chop. It's just a strum without the chord sound. You don't let go of the chord, you're just muting with this hand, like I said earlier. Because the verses are really chill, so he doesn't do a lot of strumming, but when he goes to the interludes, and then in the left hand, when he goes to E minor, and this is in the other video also, probably in more detail, he strums down and hammers with these two fingers. then splits his fingers for the D F sharp. Let me show you the left hand.
drums are hard because you do two in a row. C, G, two upstrokes. Just like that. that helps clarify the strumming part but in my opinion I think it's more the left hand that causes the problems with the strumming than it is the strumming hand. 